should you get your paper remarked if you're not happy with the grades? One question we get asked a lot is, should I get my paper remarked? Now, with GCSE results just around the corner, you might be wondering whether you should get your paper remarked. And it's an important decision and we're here to help you weigh up the pros and cons. So let's break down what you need to consider. So first and foremost, you need to think about your critical subjects. If you didn't pass subjects like maths or English, remember that you'll need to resit them next year. If you're just a couple of marks away from a passing grade, say two marks off a of four, a remark might be worth it. This is going to save you from having to retake that exam. Now, if you want a final breakdown of the marks to see how close you are, you might need to speak to the exams officer. You also want to consider the cost of remarks as well. Remarks can cost around £42-ish, depending on the exam board, so for example like AQA. If you are considering this, you want to discuss it with your family as the cost might fall on you, what with school budgets at the moment. Some schools do pay for it, so you'll just have to kind of speak with them, but it's not the case for every school. It is important to know, though, that for some exam boards, if you do submit for a remark and this results in a grade change, you'll be refunded. You're also going to want to consider the risks of remarks. It's important to understand this. If you submit papers for review and nothing changes, it could be a waste of money. Plus, remarks can result in grades going down as well as up. So make sure you're prepared for any outcome. Now, this one's an important one for me as well need versus want. I want you to ask yourself if you actually need that remark. Is it going to affect your college or sixth form place or is it just about improving your grade? If your future plans aren't impacted by this current grade, it might not be worth the risk. Lastly, and I say this in so many of my videos, but speak to your teacher. So before making a decision, talk to them. They can request a copy of your papers for free and help you assess whether a remark is likely to be beneficial. They can have a look over the paper and see if anything looks wrong because that's going to reduce the risk of the grade going down. Ultimately, their advice is going to be invaluable in making an informed choice. So the decision to get a paper remarked is a personal one, but it should be made with careful consideration of the factors that we've discussed. So make sure to weigh up the potential benefits against the costs and the risks. Good luck with results day. And if this applies to you, good luck with your decision. Hopefully it's not one that you'll need to make, but if you have any questions or need more advice, leave a comment and we'll try our best to help you out.